Hello and welcome to My Support Solution YouTube channel. In this video session, we will learn about GR Block Stock in SAP. But before we start, if you have not yet subscribed to our My Support Solution YouTube channel, then click on the subscribe button, click on the bell icon, and select all notifications to get the latest and free updates after every new video upload. If you like our video, then please click on the like button. Also, share our videos. Now we'll start our topic. So first. We'll discuss about the topic and then we'll do example. Our company is ABC Limited. We have one plant 1000. This is our plant code and our vendor code is 1000. We have created one purchase order 45001-17287 for 10 pieces, 10 quantity for material 100-100. It is our business policy or business decision that Whenever we receive this material from our vendor, our plant or warehouse persons should check the material before posting goods receipt into unrestricted use stock. So at the time of checking of this material, we found that out of these 10 pieces, 8 pieces are okay, but the balance 2 pieces are defective or damaged, which we will have to return to our vendor. So this is only for example. Now in our practical sessions, our first step will be movement type 103 that is post goods receipt in MIGO transaction code. We will use movement type 103. 103 is as we can observe the below screenshot goods receipt for purchase order into GR block stock. That is this 10 pieces initially we will move to GR block stock for checking of the physical quantity as well as, as well as quality of the product. Then we have to note here that system will generate the material document after posting but system will not update the stock also accounting document will not get generated after posting of a movement type 103. In our second step, we will release the GR block stock in MIGO transaction code itself, but we will use a movement type 105. Here, we will release this GR block stock for 8 quantity. Out of this 10 quantity, we, we have found 8 quantity or 8 pieces are in good condition or okay, which we can sell to our customer. So second step will be release GR block stock moment type 105. After posting of this document, system will generate material document. Also system will update the inventory and accounting document will get generated. The last step will be return delivery moment type 124 for the balance two pieces which we have found damage or defective. We have to return to our vendor. So this will be three steps. So first step, MIGO transaction code moment type 103 for this 45000 purchase order. We start our practical now. MIGO transaction code MIGO goods receipt against purchase order. Purchase order number is 45000 287 press enter here our movement type is 103 in case our movement type uh, here was uh, say the standard is 101 then we have to change this to 103 because we have to post a goods receipt for movement type 103 that is GR block stock right now this is a 103 now here 10 pieces we will post a goods receipt for full 10 pieces 10 quantity there is no storage location okay we are not going to store this material or system will not generate any accounting document or 
here bill of lading field is mandatory hence you have to give bill of lading number into the field or column will post the document for 103 movement type material document 45016 this is our initial material document for 103 movement type now second step will be release gr block stock movement type 105 for eight pieces which we have found in good condition movement type 105 release of gr block stock with reference to this initial material document now here we can observe there is a column or there is a option of storage location means we will save this material we will save or store this material in our plant eight pieces here we will change the quantity we have found eight pieces in good condition okay we can refer to our to our example eight pieces are okay so 105 eight pieces click on check document document is okay and we will post after the process we will also check our uh, purchase order history for the respective purchase order material document 45017 has been posted now last step will be return delivery for the balance two pieces okay against this initial material document oh sorry 45016 is our initial material document uh, written delivery to vendor 45016 enter here we will change the quantity quantity is two pieces that we are returning the defective pieces which we have found out of this initial 10 quantity okay so these are the two pieces the reason for moment here is mandatory field so give reason for moment we have already defined a uh, reason for moment in our customization settings we will create a separate video on that our uh, bill of lighting is already mentioned click on the check button and then we will post the document material document 45018 has been posted now we will check the purchase order history slash n me 23n press enter so we have posted three material document 450161718 uh, this is our purchase order number 17287 purchase order history Now see here we can observe the our uh, initial document is 450164 moment type 103. See here system has not update quantity okay as well as cost. Second 105 moment type system update here 8 pieces which we have posted that is the uh, good stock which we have found found okay eight pieces and this is a respective value and this is last that is 124 moment <coughs> sorry 124 moment type we have returned the uh, two pieces to our vendor okay so that's all for now in this video for uh, the topic of gr block stock in sap Thank you for watching, keep in touch and bye bye.